The perfect compost recipe, the balance of green and brown materials. One of the reasons to reduce waste is to conserve space in our landfills. Landfills take up valuable space and are a source of air and water pollution. By reducing our waste, we are also conserving our resources. Composting reduces the organic trash we send to the landfill. Composting is a great way to turn our food scraps into fertilizer for our garden. There is a proper way to composting. We have to feed the pile appropriately. This will ensure that microorganisms are breaking down the mix. Composting includes a balanced browns mix and greens mix. Greens are materials that are rich in nitrogen or protein. They are also the items that tend to heat a compost pile up because they help the microorganisms in the pile grow and multiply quickly. Browns are carbon or carbohydrate rich materials. The main job of browns in a compost pile is to be food sources for all of the soil dwelling organisms that will work with the microbes to break down the contents of your compost pile. Also, brown materials help to add bulk and help allow air to filter through the pile. All forms of kitchen waste can be composted. However, try not to compost meat, dairy, and fats. These items will eventually break down but take much longer. Also, these items are guaranteed to smell bad and attract flies, rodents, and other unwanted pests. What are the browns for the compost pile? Brown materials for composting include dry or woody plant materials. In most cases, these materials are brown, or naturally turn brown. Here are examples of brown materials. Fall leaves Pine needles Twigs, chip tree branches or bark Straw or hay Chemical free sawdust Corn stalks Paper like newspaper, writing or printing paper, paper plates and napkins, coffee filters Dryer lint Cotton fabric Corrugated cardboard without any waxy or slick paper coatings What are the greens for the compost pile? Green materials for composting consists mostly of wet or recently growing materials. Green materials usually come from plants. Here are the best green materials for your compost. Grass clippings Coffee grounds or tea bags Vegetable and fruit scraps Trimmings from plants Weeds that have not set seed Eggshells and seaweeds You can also use animal manure from cow, horse, sheep, chicken, rabbit, to name a few But no dog or cat manure The ideal ratio of browns to greens is 3 parts browns to 1 part greens However, you do not need to be exact about it if you do not get a good mix of brown and green materials, your compost pile may not heat up, may take forever to break down, and may start stinking up the place. These issues can usually be fixed by tweaking the ratio. If you find that your compost pile is not heating up, then you may need to add more green material to the compost. If you find that your compost pile is starting to smell, you may need to add more browns. In the end, decomposition happens. It is a natural process. Diverting waste away from landfills prevents pollution that can harm our health and the environment. Composting is our simple contribution in saving our planet.